Okay, we are playing Gift. Gift. Uh, okay, here's some of here's a game that some of you may have not heard of before. It's Gift. It's a platforming game. When I tried searching it on YouTube, it was very little. So I'm sorry if any of you think I'm a bit weird or mental recording a game with you about it, but oh well. Let's start with new game. Let's turn up the volume. There's the, there's the boss woman there. Okay, so if you haven't right gathered yet, this game is about an anti-hero called a, a, some sort of alien thing called a uh, gift. I don't get this game too, but and I think the reason why you don't see many game reviews of this is because gift is a little bit of a ladies guy, even though on the box it says three plus. Yes. But you can see the platforming elements here. Instead of a shadow, it's like a little aiming arrow thing. And plus, you can you can actually die in this room, so be careful. So we are now at the main hall. Well, here we go. This, I got this game as you all know, a gift. And it's telling you that these are the levels, you move the right directional buttons and things for, for the analog. So it's pretty easy, you just run up to this thing whenever you see it. Go on these strange red blutes and press the attack button, which is the square button. 
and if you press the square button again with this, it should take you back up. Or the X button, I don't know which. So the X button, or the square button, will teleport you to this level. The levels may be locked first, but, oh well, here's the next one. I am the shadow of the black deep darkness of the night, and you, weakling, So you see Gift is a little bit of a coward, a scaredy cat, you get the picture, he's not really a hero. He just came for the job because he knew there was a pretty woman. Now these are black shadows. If you, if you, if you get in the way, they will kill you. But they don't like dark. Like yin and yang, the black, the little black shadows don't like light. Don't like dark. And the little lights, sh lights, don't like dark. Yes, there's a there's another monster of these that don't like the dark, like the anti opposite of it. And there we go. I've just lost a few health. Why am I uh, recording this? Oh well. Because I want to. And come on, people, you've got to make a version of Gift for YouTube. Come on. How can we overlook such a fantastic platforming element, I think? Here's some magic powers. Your staff needs it, for its power is functional. Yeah. Are there some more dark shadow-ish things? The best thing I like about this game, it has like cutscenes like this, where you, where gift interacts with things, gets scared with things. It's just amazing. Of course, this makes your game longer, and some people don't like cutscenes at all. And there's your magical power. It's a some sort of yellow thing. If you run past it, it should make a some sort of noise. And you remember the dark, n lonely nights. It's here. Now I don't know about you guys, but this bit reminds me of Crash Bandicoot. Remember that bit guys with Crash in it? Um where you in the night and you have to try and try and uh, do those that th I just don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Basically, Crash Bandicoot 2, you do that sort of thing in there. These are the little lights. They're, the, they're like the opposite of the shadows. Just the hate, the, da the light. Remember when I was saying yin and yang? And don't, and yes, they will kill you. I will try and do more with I will try to do a bit more longer with you but we're ordered takeout and we don't know whether that's gonna arrive or my camera's gonna say right no more films for you mister which I 
definitely hope not. And this is what we call a shadow gun. It free it's a weapon that strong that freezes your shadow. Now this level is just for the like the starter level. <sighs> oh yes. The guns freeze our machine. The machine. So these little dog thingy wi thingy wing is uh they're called dogs and they're fighters. What you can do with the fighters, you can usually kill them. Some of them you can't. It depends how little they are. Remember the saying, pick on somebody your own size. Well that's our own size. Well that's the size for us anyway. Oh fudge. You <laughs> you you are oh, no weird doggish things. Oh no glitch no no don't glitch don't freeze don't glitch I won't have time to go in there but Ouch. Do you know how hard it is to play with one foot? And you collect those little garden gnome things, yes. It's creepy, weird. What did you win? It's ridiculous. All that for a dwarf. <laughs> And he's suddenly become popular in the eyes of the public, blah blah blah, whatever, whatever. So you'll go through some sci-fi, some fantasy levels. Oh yeah, I didn't want to save. Good thing I didn't have a memory card, isn't it? Okay, and we're going to go down here to show you a few more levels. Down! Now this is my favourite level. Well, my favourite level is level 2. But the music, the music is absolutely good. I mean, it's good. Sorry for the dodgy camera angle, but... Oh. Oh, let me just... I'll leave it at this volume now. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, look at that camera effect. Gotta love this. Now listen to this music. I mean, it's good, so I'm... Stop going to talk. And if you have any questions, tough.
wow, what were the gamers thinking when they designed this? I mean, the game designers actually made this game. They thought this is going to be a pretty good track and they did it. And I'm glad they have did. I don't know whether this was made by by people from college or uni but you've got but this game is absolutely good I mean it's wow I love the mysteriousness of this all my magic no Basically, this is a this is a like a point getting from point A to point B. And oh my gosh, look at this! Oh, that that magic hasn't been activated. Looks like you have to activate <laughs> magic staffs in order to use them in this game. Oh well. But the invisible platforms are are absolutely good if you don't know what they are. Well, if you don't know where you're going. Ouch. Oh. I'm just looking at my camera. And I'm sorry if this is this review's not scripted, but I just wanted to do a review about gift. I mean come on, is it He's quite cute, actually. And I bet he will win the girl. So we're just going through this hall. I actually thought my... F I thought... I thought Mum's friend end that gave me that gave me this was a bit bonkers but actually I enjoy it quite much and I think you would too if you if so the next time your boy wants him something buy him a PlayStation 2 and gift they'll like that <laughs> I think Ooh, these automatic, automatic things. By the way, this is a shadow gun. It doesn't kill anybody. It's you. It says here is a shadow gun. It is use it to shoot at shadows. To do, to do this, press the shadow gun button. Which is probably the triangle button. Nope. It's a so basically, you'll find out how it works sooner or later. Now this is how it works. Like the game Portal at where you get a gun at fire's portal on this you get a gun at fire's shadow it's pretty dark isn't it oh gosh yes frozen now that's what I'm talking about whoa I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say, you guys, if you, if you haven't left your laptops already or computers, you've been very patient with me. So 
So I need to freeze him, otherwise he'll chop me up. <laughs> oh no, I hate this bit. I hate it. I hate it so much. Yes. Bye bye, little shadows. The dark poems. Mo ha 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 ha. I wonder if this game actually came out near Halloween because it is like that a little bit if you think about it. And look, I've finally got. Ah, oh, fudge. I finally got to the platform without dying. Yes. Come on, why won't you get up on the ladders? No! <laughs> so unfair holding a camera and after. I need both hands for this, so if the camera falls, I'm sorry. But I just need both hands. It's physically impossible to play it with but one. But I am pr I think I am getting better at it though. Gotta admit. Ouch. Yes. Another thing if you use your if you use your this you can actually if you use your staff when you fall you can actually oh gosh you killed me can actually try and break your fall a little bit oh no he's he's going I don't want you to go that way. Gosh. Yes. And what do we do? We get a mi other mysterious. Uh... What? No gnome. Okay. All these gnomes actually, um, they're actually part of the storyline. No electricity that time? Wow! Ooh. This game's a bit glitchy with electricity, so you won't see that much, unfortunately. Just activated the black power <laughs> markers. The power puts puts you into the dark. So he's actually working with the dark this time. Oh, this level is good. It's like the last level, but it's like a medieval castle, which I love. Ah, yes. Here's a weird fellow. It's called a Patrola. Not Specto Patrolum, but he's one of these bad guys. That he's one of these bad guys that will actually kill you and since 
And since I am on my last level, I could kill Gift, but I just don't want to. See that? My health just went down. The power of the darkness. So you have to watch out for green lights and other things like that weird red thing at shrinked gift or made gift younger again. I don't know which. To me you shrunk him. Karate! I know I can knock out one of those weird cockroaches. Now the patrollers are kind of like a... With, have you ever played one of those spy games where you have to walk past people without them detecting you? Well if they detect you they will zap you. So it's best not to get in their way. Fudge. I need another one of those w weird things. Come on, I need, I need your help. <sighs> Excuse me if I couldn't just get this box. No. It's not letting me fudge. It's also got some puzzles, some like 3D puzzles to do which can act, which some of you may not be into because it's a puz platform puzzle game and some of these puzzles are quite confusing. Not that confusing, but Look, you see, it's it's shrinking me as we speak. <laughs> Easier. See, this, see, this is what it does. It shrinks you. Or it makes you younger. I just haven't decided yet. Seems quite a lot of the platforms are there. I think I'll just... Oh gosh. This is going to be difficult. Before I... Before I go, I might as well show you what this dark shield does, basically. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now, hopefully, I want to be able to complete, uh, well, this bit just to show you. Oh. Oh, better get rid of that. So first I have to hit his shadow. Yes, that worked. Oh no! <laughs> you can see why this doesn't get a that many game reviews because it is qu even though it is a free plus you got you gotta say I gotta say this is quite scary people screaming oh dear that does not look good So sh shields protect you from dark things and 
make help you grow ish. Oh, could you stop screaming, girls? <laughs> I think it is quite scary anyway. Oh, I've run out of bullets. <laughs> and I can see the reason why m many a parent may not give, s give this to their child, even if it if it's a free plus but if you like dark stuff like me and you're a bit of a goth I would say this game would be for you except you're trying to save a princess from but there's still dark baddies but he's trying to save the princess somehow. Well, that's not entirely true. She thinks she's a princess and she's waiting for her prince charming. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll do I think I'll probably do a different game with you and have gift die <laughs> and see what happens at the end or it might happen at this end please don't kill me please don't kill me please don't kill me I have to go back to this area here and like oh sorry and get up here so I can because there's another green area deeper in the cave and I have to get rid of that in order to succeed How long would it take you to complete a game, this game? Well, I don't know. A week? <laughs> More than a week, actually. I think maybe a week if you kept on at it, but probably more like a month. Well, three weeks to be exact to complete the whole game and if you're one of these people that like to get 100% maybe this game is not for you maybe this game is for you and be like, I don't know if you wanna get 100% you need to collect those weird things planet things there and the um, bonish things, and they should unlock other things. But it, but to me, this is actually a nice little game. Even if I cannot do controlling bow for. I can see most of you if you are three. Haha! <laughs> My flame is a weapon. I see most of you if you are three. You are. You probably want. You probably have. You probably screamed at it and sent it to a charity shop. That's okay. 
even Mario isn't that scary. But actually, you'd realise it's not that it's not that scary to be honest. Oh no! Don't know what's happening here. But lucky for me, I have the um, target system. Now these little things, you'll need them. You've only got three tries at this. Then you might have to waste your life away then. And I love the camera angle, how it works. Oh, fudge! Why won't you? According to the manual, these are good guys. Hey, we did it without getting squished. There we go. There's another garden gnome for me. There's a... I've told you most of the storyline. You may not like it because it doesn't have that much story and it has more of the cutscenes. But I think it's good. The loading graphics, well, I can't complain with that. Now before I go I'm going to show you the um, competition that room if you quite like it. Or as I like to call it the Olympic room. It does look like an Olympic room a little bit or a Colosseum. This is where you get your magical powers from if it lets you. That behind that door will increase your attacking ability. Behind that door will will give you a map so you know where you've been. And behind that door you will grant the healing ability. Now I'm sorry if I spoiled the surprise for uh, you new gamers but... I'm not going any further than that, so see you later, and uh, bye for now.